Hi guys, welcome back to my video. So I don't know about you, but I absolutely love TGI's sesame seed Jack Daniels chicken strips. So because I can't get to TGI's at the moment to go get myself some chicken strips, I'm gonna make my own and I'm gonna show you how I make my sesame seed chicken strips. Okay, so I've got some chicken breast here that I'm going to cut into strips and um, washed before um, I season my chicken. Okay, so these are the ones that I've done so far. I'm just going to take this um, slimy bit off my chicken because I don't like I don't like having that on there. Okay, so basically what I'm going to do, I'm just going to go alongside and um, cut it like that. So this one I'm going to cut it down again because I don't really like them too thick because I find when they're too thick you don't really get um you don't really get that crunchiness I think. That one's fine. I'm just going to take this little bit of fatty bit off from there. I'm going to cut that in two. Okay, so that's it. My chicken is all cut. So I'm going to go ahead and wash my chicken with some um, lemon juice and then I'm going to season my chicken. Okay, so here it is. My chicken's all washed and um, cut into strips. So I'm going to go ahead and season my chicken. So I've got some black pepper. I've got um, chilli powder, I've got some paprika, I've got meat seasoning. I'm also going to use a little bit of um, jerk seasoning that's because it's got so much um, different ingredients in there that's got some really nice flavours so I'm just going to put a little bit of the jerk season and then I'm going to put just a little bit of salt as well and then mix mix it mix it mix it So there it is, I'm going to leave it and let it marinate and then I'm going to come back and show you um, what I'm going to do next. Okay guys, so in here I've got some eggs um, mixed all together. I'm going to, I've got some flour here for the coating for my chicken. So I'm going to put again a little bit of our meat season. I'm going to put some all-purpose season. I'm going to put a bit of chilli powder. And I'm also going to put a little bit of um, black pepper. I think I'm going to put a little bit of um, black pepper and a little bit of um, chilli powder in my, um, egg, in, my, in my egg. I'm just going to mix this um, all together. Okay. 
okay so what i've done i've added some of my um chicken to my whisk egg and then i'm going to um, coat them in my um, flour mixture Okay, so I'm just going to coat them into my flour mixture and then I'm going to um, fry them. Okay, so that's basically it. Okay, so what I've got here, I've got um, a pad with some vegetable oil. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and um, add my chicken to it. My oil is already hot, so I'm just going to go ahead and um, add my chicken to, to it. So I literally only let it fry for about um, four minutes because they cut quite thinly anyway, so they, um, they cook quite quickly. It doesn't take that long to for them to um, fry. I think I've cut that one a bit too big, but it's okay, it doesn't matter. So I'm going to leave that there and let them um, cook. Okay guys, so this is what the chicken look like after I finish frying them. So I fried them for about... Um, four or five minutes you don't really need to fry them for much longer because they're um they're cut in like small strips they don't take as long to um fry so i'm just gonna go ahead now and make my sauce that i'm gonna coat the chicken in okay guys so i've got some honey in here i'm then gonna add some um soy sauce I'm going to do about three tablespoons of um, soy sauce. One, two, three. I'm then going to add some ketchup. So again, I'm going to do about three um, tablespoons of ketchup. Oop. Does it seem to want to come out? One second. Okay. Okay, there we go. So, one, two, three. I'm going to add um, some brown sugar. So, I'm not going to put too much sugar in there because I don't want it to be um too sweet so one two i'll say about three um actually two and a half um teaspoon of sugar i'm gonna add a little bit of water as well and just mix it
I've got some cornstarch there that I'm going to use to thicken my sauce. I'll show you um, what I mean. Okay guys, so I've um, washed my pan out. I'm then going to add my um, sauce to the pan. Just make sure you scrape all the air. Okay, so. got some garlic that I've like diced really small I'm gonna add that to to my sauce okay so what I'm doing I'm gonna wait for it to start boiling and then I'm gonna add my um, cornstarch the mixture of my um, cornstarch Just wait for it to start bubbling. Okay guys, so when it's like this, um, you can um, go ahead and add your, um, your cornstarch just to thicken the sauce a bit. So I'm just going to add that amount. Just make sure you're constantly mixing because you don't want it to burn or stick to the pan. I think I might add a little bit more um, cornstarch to it. This actually smells so nice, like, smells lovely. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and um, add my chicken add my chicken to it I'm just turn it down a little because I don't want it to start burning okay so I'm gonna add my chicken to it Okay guys, so this is what it looks like. I've got some um, sesame seed that I've already roasted. I'm gonna do another video of um, how I roast my sesame seeds. So I'm just gonna sprinkle it all over, all over my chicken. I think I'm going to add a little bit more sesame seed to it. So I'm going to make some um, egg fry rice to have my sesame seeds chicken strips with. I'm also going to do another video showing you how I do my egg fry rice okay guys so here it is here's what it looks like 
So I've got some um, chopped spring onion on top of it and added a little bit more sesame seed. Okay guys, so this is my egg fried rice that I'm going to serve with my chicken. I'm going to do a, another video of how um, I've made my um, egg fried rice. Okay, here it is guys. Um, Dinner is all ready. Um, please give it a try and let me know what you think. If you like my video, please give me a big thumbs up and, and subscribe to my channel.